right, good day guys and welcome to another SMC tutorial video. Alright, so in today's video, I'm going to be introducing you guys to a tool that is going to revolutionize your trading experience on the Solana ecosystem, right? So in recent months, Solana has experienced exponential growth. The Solana ecosystem has experienced exponential growth, attracting both retailers and wheels alike, right? So um, in recent months, we've seen a lot of projects come to Solana and we've seen, you know, the massive growth that Solana has experienced, right? So now this growth comes with a need for speed, right? With a whole lot of traders in the market. Various traders require speed to execute trades and buy into meme coins as early as possible, right? So now this led to the creation of sniper bots on the Solana ecosystem. And this too has seen its own exponential growth, right? So um, there have been various launches on, on, you know, on the Solana network, various big launches on the Solana network, which have, you know, created the need for speed, right? We saw um, Dog with Hearts, which runs billions of dollars in market cap and is still sitting at, I think, about $3, $3 billion in market cap. We saw um, Bonk, which also did billions, right? And we also saw some decent projects that, you know, that did millions like um, Miro, um, like like Pepe too, like Pepe on the, on the, on the Solana ecosystem and, yeah, so there are top chains for meme coins at the moment, being Solana and Biz, right? And watch out, because if I've made any video on a bot previously, I can say that this is pretty decent and probably a better platform, right? So um, yeah, like I said before, we've had various great launches on the Solana ecosystem, which um, if people were able to get in earlier through sniping, they would have you know made way more money, right? And this is why I am introducing you to this too, right? So um, with the trend of meme coins, right? A lot of bots have also been built. There are many bots available for sniping tokens on Solana chain. You know, we have ones that are built on the web. We have ones that are built on TG as Telegram bots, right? And yeah, we have ones that are built only for, you know, specific platforms like Discord, right? But then some only offer, you know, the Telegram, some only offer one, right? Some offer only the Telegram bot, while some only offer that of the site, right? But today, the bot I'm going to be talking about is one of my favorites. Um, it's the Auto Snipe AI bot, and this bot is different, right? It is available on a website, Telegram, and Discord, and currently it has a fully functional website and a simple user interface, right? And what's even better is that Auto Snipe's fees are much lower compared to other bots right so as you can see right um sniping meme coins is like a huge deal um in today's market right especially on the solana ecosystem you can see that the total market capitalization of you know meme coins at the moment is at about 64 billion dollars with a trading volume of about 8 billion dollars right and this is um these are meme coins that are being tracked on you know um verified um, analytics platforms like CoinMarketCap and CoinGecko, right? So there are meme coins being launched every day that people make money from that probably do not make it to these analytic platforms at times, right? So um, so let's get started. I'll show you how you can use auto snipe bots to snipe tokens at hyper speed, right? Um, all right, so um, we're just going to leave this. I'm going to impute autosnipe.ai. All right, so you can see now that, you know, the bot has opened up. Auto snipe the AI, buy and sell Solana tokens at hyper speed, connect your wallet and start sniping memes now, right? So you can scroll down and see, you know, the, the different features, right? All Solana based meme coins at um, lightning speed, deposit to Solana chain from any other chain, automatic rock detection and removal, MEV protection for all your buys and sells. And, you know, there is also an AI based risk analysis and management, you know, set up coming soon to the bot, right? So you're going to have to install your Phantom wallet and, you know, connect it to login to autosnipe.ai, right? So you are going to, you know, do this, right? I already have a Phantom wallet set up, so I'm just going to connect my wallet, right? All right, so autosnipe AI has sent us a request to connect to our wallet, right? You can see I already have a funded wallet here with a little bit of Solana. And yeah, I'm just going to tap connect. And yeah, now we are going to be asked to verify and sign. So we verify and sign, and then um, a signature should pop up on our Phantom wallet in a couple of seconds. Okay, yes. And then we approve this. And yeah, 
Yeah, you're good to go. Right, you're good to go. So we just wait for it to load up. And yeah, okay, now that we've, you know, signed and, you know, yeah, we've done all those things, Auto Snipe is currently available on invites only, right? It's currently available on invites only. And we are giving our access code to the first 200 people to use our access code, right? We are giving access to the bots, to the first 200 people to use our access code, which is SMC Tutors. And you hit continue. And this should give you access to the bots in a couple of seconds. All right, guys. So immediately your access code has been accepted. You are going to see this menu, right? You're going to see this. Uh, your bot should look like this, yeah? So this takes us directly to new pairs, right? It takes us directly to new pairs. And you can see the newest pairs that are being created on the Solana network, right? You can see L-Snipe. You can see Peace Pepe. You can see Throg, Maneki, and yeah. Yeah, and PG that just launched like right now, right? So you can see various um projects on you know the auto snipe AI bot interface. You can see that the UI is quite simple to understand, and yeah, you can see that this is you know this 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 looks good, right? So first thing that you're going to have to do when you you know when your access code has been accepted is to fund your wallet, right? So you're going to do that by going here and you're going to tap trading wallet right so now um auto snipe ai has um a feature where you have a trading wallet and then um it's very very separate from your so auto snipe ai has um it has a feature right where you can separate your um your your trading wallet or where you separate your trading wallet from your phantom wallet right so um yeah you have a trading wallet where you can which you can fund directly and you also have you know your phantom wallet which you can withdraw to right so every trade is not being made with your phantom wallet but with your trading wallet in you know the auto snipe ai site right in the on, on the website with your profile right and each trading you know wallet is associated with your profile right so now as you can see i've already funded my wallet with a little bit of solana about 0 0.095 that's about 16 dollars right so you can see that you can deposit Solana, Solana directly into the trading wallet, right? So you can just copy address and then, you know, send Solana to this directly. You can deposit and, you know, you can deposit through a bridge, right? Where you're able to bridge from the Binance Smart Chain, um, Optimism, Ethereum to Solana and then fund your wallet with it. And then you're also able to withdraw, right? So now this is probably after you've made a couple of trades right and then you want to withdraw to your um main wallet right so this is my main wallet address this is my phantom wallet address and this is my trading wallet and then when i have made profit or whenever i feel like withdrawing from my trading wallet balance i just come here choose the maximum amount of tokens or just choose whatever amount of tokens and then pay the priority fee which is less than i think this is less than 10 cents and then i hit the withdraw button right like i said you can also um bridge right you can bridge from ethereum to solana right as a way of depositing you can bridge from the bnb chain polygon arbitrum avalanche you know linear optimism base and so on and so forth right you can just connect your ethereum wallet and you know run the bridge and have it, you know, and have the, the bridge to Lana funded into your wallet, right? So yeah, let us head on back to the bot and to tap this, we are going to head on back to new pairs. All right. So basically, um, when you, you know, when you join the auto snipe AI bot, it, it shows you like the newest pairs on the market, right? So this shows you the newest pairs on the market, you know, as they are being deployed in real time, right? And you can see that they have various, you know, discrepancies, right? So now you can see some of these tokens have, they don't have a tag on the side, right? And if you've heard about pump.phone, you should know that projects have been launched on pump.phone, right? So yeah, the projects with these, um, these pump.phone stickers or pump.phone, you know, logos are actually projects that are being launched on pump.phone, right? So it also differentiates those projects from projects that just go live directly on radium right so you can check out new pairs right now you can see the the market cap of the tokens here you can see the number of transactions with green being the buy and red being the sell right you can also um sorry you can also scroll and you can see these analytics right you can see med let me 
tap info to you know show you what it's all about right so med is mint um or disabled right this means that the mint authority is disabled right so this will not allow the creator of the token to bring new supply into the market fad is freeze authority disabled now this will not allow the creator of the token to freeze specific addresses to transfer tokens right so there are cases on solana where a developer can freeze the account of you know of people and then they are not able to sell their tokens right so lb means lp bond or lp bond right and this shows the amount of uh, tokens bonds on the lp right on solana it's usually a hundred percent right and then t10 is about like the top 10 holders right this is the percentage of tokens being held by the top 10 accounts there will be a green check if the top 10 owns less than 15 percent of the token supply right so um yeah so as you can see these new projects new projects do not really um check all these boxes immediately right but some of them try to do right you can see beast paper has um, um mint authority disabled right you can see he has mint authority disabled it has you know freeze authority disabled it has um the lp the lp has been burnt right um the lp has been burnt and you can also see that um the top 10 holders do not hold less than 15 percent so if the top 10 holders held less than 15 percent it would be in the good right so you can also see the liquidity you can also see the initial liquidity so you're able to narrow it down to how well the project has done since launch right um you can also look at the volume right and also you know check this out um you know you can check check it out to you know um know the projects that have been doing well volume wise right so after checking all these things and they look good you can just tap the buy button right but then before we head on to buy let me show you the other section which is the top pairs right so now top pairs shows you the highest performing projects on the solana ecosystem in different timestamps or different time frames right so now this is the six hour time frame right so these are the the projects that have been performing the best in the last six hours right you can see that like i said before older projects have all these metrics you know they've met the requirements of all these metrics right you can see that pang right here has um mint authority disabled it has you know freeze authority disabled 100 percent of lp has been burned and the top 10 holders do not hold more than 15 percent of you know the token supply right you can check out the liquidity you can see it has done about 889 percent right you can see the volume is about 7.21 million dollars right this looks um pretty pretty decent and the current liquidity is at about 101k and the market cap is at around six hundred and ninety four thousand dollars right so these are the top performing projects in the last six hours so you can narrow it down to 24 hours you can narrow it down to an hour you can narrow it down to five minutes yeah whatever you you know you want to do right so now there is also an instant buy feature but before we do that let's just um look for a project to buy into right so um Compared to the amount of money I have right here, I want to find something that is relatively lower, right? Something I can do probably a couple of, you know, X's, two or three X. And I'm looking at Bonnie.so here. Bonnie, Bonnie. I'm looking at the Bonnie project here. This looks pretty good. It has um, decent volume. So I'm just going to click buy, right? So this is not instant buy. This is just a normal buy, right? So I'm going to pick um, 0. Point, let's say 0. 0.05. Um, Solana, or let's just say 0 0.03 Solana, right? And we are going to buy this token. Now you can also choose advanced settings, right? But then uh, our buy is already initiated. But then when we go on to instant buy, you can choose advanced settings, right? So we wait while our transaction is getting okay. Wow, the transaction has already executed, and we can view this in the holding section, right? But before we do that it's taking us to the you know transaction on so scan right but then if you head over to settings you know you can choose um to set a priority fee right you can choose to set the amount of priority fee and even with a low priority fee you can see that the transactions are still very very fast right so you can choose it you can choose an extremely high priority fee you can choose high you can choose medium you can choose low and you can start a MEV protection right but then this MEV protection requires a bribery right so once you hit enable you can choose a bribery amount and you know yeah the amount that you want to pay validators to prioritize your transaction right so now um you can see that our our buyers already executed even with a low priority fee 
right and now um i would like to show you guys how to use the instant buy right so there's a feature where you can use um instant buy right this makes your buying experience very very fast right so we are going to tap this it's at the bottom here i'm going to activate instant buy we are going to click this to choose the amount of solana we want to buy with instantly i'm going to go with 0.02 and yeah that's just about it that's just about it yeah so we've activated um our instant buy right you can see now every project has a lightning by the side um let's try this with bunny again um instant buy and then boom our buy uh, has initiated so you wouldn't need to add the amount of um of money that you want to buy with with instant buy right you wouldn't have to go through the process of you know choosing you know the priority fee if you want it to be low or if you want it to be high and all that yeah so our transaction has been initiated with instant buy and yeah that's basically it right so you can see that you know um the highest performing projects are here we've had we've seen good projects to you know ape into and then one thing that i have to notice is that you can also filter this down right we are going to look at our holdings in a bit but you're going to have to feel you can you know use the filter to filter um to filter out projects that you feel that are not good right so we're going to head on to filters and then you can see that you can you know um you can make your choices based off your trading style right so if you wanted to you can show tokens that have mint authentication or mint authority disabled you can show tokens that have lp bonds tokens that the top 10 holders are holding less than 15 percent projects with at least one social media account projects that have freeze um authority disabled and you can also show projects from pom.fun right so you can choose this in whatever way you like you can also choose the least amount of liquidity or the range of liquidity that you're good with buying you can also choose the range of volume that you're good with buying the range of market cap transactions buys and sales and yeah i'm just going to disable um pom.fun and probably disable um mint authority okay no means authority is very important um let's do top 10 holders right and then you can, you know, make sure you hide the rogues, right? So that you don't, you know, fall into rogues. Autosnipe AI has a feature where, you know, they try their very best to hide rogues away from users, right? And only show them, you know, um, um, tokens that have potential, right? So we are going to apply this filter and you'd see that, you know, you see that much doesn't really change. You can see that the only thing that we have on our X's here are projects that don't have, um, I don't have less than 15 percent as the top holder that like the top holders are not holding less than 15 percent you can see that it has filtered it out and you can see that every other filter is functioning at the moment right so you can see punk right here you can see you you can see maga you can see knife you can see beer right and then you can you know also refresh to get like a better result and all right so yeah after refreshing you can see that you know the top 10 doesn't really have um doesn't really have like any changes we have ones that do not have we have ones that have right it has probably it has just filtered it out but you can see that there are consistencies with the mint um the freeze and then the lp bone right so yeah this is basically how to use the filters also make sure that you know you use the the anti rock function right you know to make sure that you get out of rocks and yeah um you know auto snipe ai is relatively you know easier to use it's you know it has a very very lovely interface right you can head over to settings like i said before you can increase your slippage you can set your priority fee you can um, enable smart math protection and you know um, you can choose your bribery amount probably 0 0.01 or 0 0.001 right but you should know that there is um yeah, is a bribery amount that you know makes your uh, makes your snipe faster, which is um, about 0 0.01, right? So you, I'm just going to choose 0 0.001. I'm going to save these settings, right? You can do it for buy and sell, and yeah, basically that's just about it, right? So I'm going to head over to our holdings, right, so that we will see the project that we just bought, which is Bunny, right? You can see the liquidity, you can see the amount invested, which is about 0 0.05 Solana. Yeah, we can see that okay we are we are we have this number amount of tokens remaining and the amount of solana remaining from the trade we've sold zero solana and we are in a loss of about 11 percent right so now you can also share your pnl from here by tapping this 
yeah so you can share your pnl you can copy the image you can copy um the image with a link you can copy the image itself right you can you know um scan a qr code or whatever right but then i'll just copy the image and then i can paste it to my friends or send it on my status or my telegram status or wherever or on twitter to you know share my pnl with you know friends right so yeah this is basically how to you know this is basically how to see your holdings, you see your PNL, you see the amount of tokens that you bought, invested, you see the, the tokens that are remaining, and then you can also decide to sell when you are in profit, right? So when you head over to the sell section, you can see the advanced settings for sell, right? You can see that we have a slippage at 10, our priority fee is low, smart move protection is enabled, right? You can also decide to disable it too. Right, and then yeah, let's just sell about 50% of our tokens and we're going to tap sell token. And yeah, boom, our sale has been initiated and should go through in a matter of seconds, right? Should go through in a matter of seconds. And yeah, this is basically how to, you know, buy and sell using the auto snipe AI bot, right? So after you've, you know, run through your trades, you know, you're, you're, you've, you've made profit, right? You can now go on to withdraw your, your tokens, right? From your trading wallet by heading on to trading wallets. And yeah, you see um, the sold, um, the sold Solana from um, the project we just bought has reflected here. You can head over to withdraw and then you choose the maximum amount of tokens. You pay the priority fee and then you hit the withdraw button, right? So history is also coming to auto snipe the AI where you'll be able to view your withdrawal history. And yeah, you'll be able to view your bridge history, your deposit and your withdrawal, right? So I'm um, going to head on back to, you know, you can also see that trading transactions are also coming to auto snipe the AI documentation. You can read auto snipe the AI's documentation and you can also log out right you can also log out probably when you're done trading or you want to take a break you can log out and you know come back at your own you know time right so we are going to head on back to our holdings and we are going to see that okay yeah we're going to see that you know we have 0 0.02 solana left after selling 50 percent and yeah you can see our p and l at this point our profit and loss right so um yeah Auto Sniper AI has a lot of features, right? It has the lowest fees compared to any other trading board that I've seen. Um, it has, you know, features of Auto Snipe, you know, right? Like the, the instant buy, which is the Auto Snipe, right? Um, it has a, a, an anti rogue you know, um, um, feature, right? It has an anti rogue feature where users are able to filter our rogues. It has less fees, like I said before. It is very, very easy to understand market flow, right? If you want to view it on the bigger screen, you can use your PC. It has a very, very lovely UI too, right? You can, you know, like I said, you can remove the rogue option and, you know, yeah, you can, you can do so many things with, you know, with this board, right? And it makes it easier. You don't have to alternate between deck screener and you know your your telegram bot to buy into a project right and then if you also see a project that is interesting probably you've gotten it from an alpha group or whatever you can come here and paste the tokens contract address right and you'd see that the project would come up right so yeah you can choose from your holdings or you can search from all the pairs that are available um in the market right so yeah this is basically how to use autosnipe.ai. Hope you guys have fun trying this out, right? I hope you guys have fun trading with this bot, right? Also, do not forget to sign up with our access code SMC Tutors, right? Also, don't forget to like and subscribe. And I hope you guys have fun trying this out. I'll see you in the next video.